Hi, it's Ryan here again, Product Manager at TeamView Remote. Today, I will show you how to start a remote support session using the TeamViewer ID and password of the device that you want to connect to. To connect this way, you will need to ask the end user of the device that you want to connect to for their TeamViewer ID and password. These credentials, the ID and password, can be found in both the full desktop app and the quick support application. In the desktop app, you'll find these details on the start screen. To use the new TeamViewer, TeamViewer Remote, you need to have an account to start an outgoing connection. These are connections when you want to connect to another user's device. An account is not required to receive connections. Just to repeat, an account is not required to receive connections to your device. Just like in the previous version of TeamViewer, you can start a session from the global search. To do this, you just type in or copy the ID and hit enter. Next, you will need to enter in the password to start the session. And this is just one of the ways that you can connect and provide remote support instantly. For more information, to get the very best out of TeamViewer Remote, head over to our community today.